I'm Steve Reich, State Representative of the 63rd District in McHenry County. Yesterday in his budget address, the governor announced that he was taking $175 million out of the road fund and putting it toward mass transit. That will allow him to not take $175 million out of general revenue so that he can apply it to other programs such as his $180 some million dollar expansion of assistance to migrants. What's important to know here is the fact that since 2019, inflation has eaten away at the value of the projects that are funded by the road fund. I'll give you a for instance. In Woodstock, Route 47 is being widened through town and the cost of relocating utilities was originally bid in 2019 at six million dollars. Last week we heard from IDOT that because of inflation only, the cost of removing of moving those utilities is now 16 million dollars, which means that the taxpayers of Woodstock have got to come up with an additional 10 million dollars just because of inflation. So the issue is why is the governor taking money out of the road fund where inflation has eaten away at everybody's budget? This is not just Woodstock, this is statewide. $175 million may not be much in the larger scheme of things when it comes to road construction in Illinois, but every dollar counts and this is money that should not be taken out of the road fund and should be kept there for the purposes for which it was collected.